All right, in this tutorial, I'm going to explain how to set the default working directory for R. And if you do this properly, you only have to do it once, and it'll save you a lot of headaches throughout the semester. So, first I'd like for you to notice that here is the shortcut to R that I just have on my desktop. Um, when you installed it, you should should have created a short a shortcut to the, to the program or you can create one easily now I'm going to right click this and I'm going to go to properties and on the shortcut menu you'll see that there's a window or a a box here labeled start in and it's set to see users Tim documents. Well, I don't want it set to that. I want to change this to my default working directory. And that way, every time R starts, it will look for files in my working directory, which I want to be different. So I'm going to cancel this. I'm going to open up Windows Explorer. I'm going to navigate to the directory that I want to use for my default working directory. For me it's going to be in uh, documents here, here, and stats fall 10. So stats fall 10 uh, actually are this then is my working directory. So this folder is where I'm going to store all my R folders and all my R files, all, all my R data sets. That way when R looks for a data set, I want it to look in this folder. All right, you got that? So I'm going to come up here. Now this is Windows 7. It's probably a little bit easier in Windows XP. I'm going to right click on the address and choose copy address as text. All right, now I can shrink this. I'll go back to my R shortcut, right click, properties. Now here at start in, I'm going to use control V to paste. And you see that it has pasted that address I just copied. You see it's academic stuff stats fall 10 R. That is what I just copied from Windows Explorer. So now, if I hit OK, and it says Windows 7 is giving me a warning, but I am an administrator, so I'm fine. So now I'm going to double click the icon to launch R. Go ahead and pull R to where you can see it. And I'm going to come down here to the cursor just to check my working directory. I'm going to type get wd open parentheses close parentheses and then hit return and you'll that's get working directory that tells me what working directories are using and here you see that it's using that address that I just typed and so now every time I launch R from this computer it'll look for files in that directory and I don't have to keep resetting the working directory that's very convenient and that's the end.